probably the most challenging A-level physics questions are describe and explain questions. There is a tip that may make them sufficiently easier. So imagine that I have a block that is connected to a spring and the system is falling to the ground. It compresses as it hits the ground and then goes back up. We're also given a graph of the compression x against time t and let's say that the graph looks something like this and uh, let's give it some numbers just as as it would on a real question so let's say that this is t is equal to zero uh, maximum compression let's say at half a second just keep things simple let's say that this here is 1.0 seconds if the spring touches the ground at t is equal to zero describe what would happen to the energy of the block in the spring let's say between t is equal to zero and t is equal to one second so my tip for these situations is to focus on the physics of the situation imagine that the block hits the ground at t is equal to zero the spring is not compressed shortly afterwards the block will start compressing like this and as it is compressing, it will be decreasing its gravitational potential energy. Because the spring, though, is being compressed, then the elastic potential energy will be increasing. At t is equal to 0.5 seconds, the compression will be at a maximum, let's say something like this. The gravitational potential energy then will be at a minimum because it's some distance away from the ground. The kinetic energy throughout this process would have decreased until it reaches zero at this point. Now the spring starts to extend like so and between t is equal to 0 0.5 and 1.0 seconds the elastic potential energy will be decreasing on the other hand the gravitational potential energy will be increasing and the kinetic energy will also be increasing if we were to focus on the physics of the situations perhaps by drawing a picture and realizing what is physically happening these questions become considerably easier there are multiple other tips that you can employ to answer describe and explain questions and i've summarized lots of them in this video that you must absolutely watch right over here.